to ask about announcement um, this week that we're sort of changing our focus, we're sort of creating, I think it's called a ring of security around Kandahar City. Um, given that the last quarterly report found that violence in Kandahar, where the Canadians have been stationed, um, is actually as bad as it was when we first uh, entered the area, how do you think we're going, when we're going to leave in 2011, how is, what are we going to be able to point to to say, like, well, we accomplished that, well, this is what, this is what makes our mission worthwhile? You know, uh, let me just say, you can point to a whole bunch of things right now. Uh, first of all, two-thirds to three-quarters of Afghanistan is normal. All the northwest, all the north center, all the northeast, all the area around Kabul. That doesn't mean that there's no violence, etc. But again, there's violence in our country, right? And it might be slightly different. Afghan army, Afghan police do all their own security in those areas, despite the numerous NATO troops which really look after themselves. little thing like a vaccination program. Here in Canada, we, we don't even think about diseases like tuberculosis and even German measles and that kind of stuff. Afghans had to live and die, more importantly, with that kind of stuff because of our work with CETA, Afghan government. Six million children were inoculated, were vaccinated against all those things. And, and guess what? A huge point of pride. Out of those six million children inoculated, not one was a hockey player. It's pretty incredible. You have to watch the third <laughs> March, have and, and so all kinds of things. But most importantly, we have helped constrain that Taliban insurgency to the southern part of Afghanistan, and that's allowed the rest of the country to carry on. 